all of this comes as we see a surge in COVID-19 cases all across Arizona. The White House Coronavirus Task Force paying attention, calling on state leaders to consider taking action. Our biggest challenge so far this year has been Chaparral, where we've had counselors, social workers, assistant principals, even the principal filling in classrooms to cover. But I have heard stories where uh, teachers might be in adjoining rooms and they're, and they're covering two classrooms. That becomes worrisome for me because we need to have a sub in each classroom. Is the Scottsdale Unified School District Superintendent Dr. Scott Menzel there talking with the governing board during last week's meeting? We just heard this is part of the breaking news that we were going to bring you at the top of the hour here. Just in the past hour, the Scottsdale Unified School District informing families that five schools will be closing tomorrow because they do not have enough staffing to fill all teacher absences. We broke that story for you, sending you that breaking news alert. Here's a list of those schools. There will be no instruction for students at Chaparral, Arcadia and Desert Mountain High Schools, along with Cocopa and Mountainside Middle Schools. A letter from the district sent earlier tonight says that this one day loss of instruction will likely have to be made up at the end of the year. Again, we heard Superintendent Menzel there talking with the governing board uh, before the Thanksgiving holiday, telling him that there was some concern regarding getting enough substitutes on certain campuses. He also put it out there that they were preparing um, to potentially close some sites after the Thanksgiving holiday due to teacher absences, um, even saying that he's heard stories of teachers having to be in adjoining rooms covering more than one classroom. Um, so it looks like some of that is playing out here uh, right now. The district's COVID-19 dashboard shows 36 confirmed active cases throughout the district and also the Maricopa County uh, Public Health Schools dashboard that just updated last week shows that Scottsdale Unified is in substantial spread that case numbers are rising and the positivity rate is just under 10%. So again, those schools that you see on your screen will be closed tomorrow. No in person, no distance learning for students in those schools. So that impacts more than 6,000 students and staff members.